Dallas police are trying to find the shooters who killed an apartment complex employee in what they say was a robbery as he was getting out of his car. It all happened this afternoon in far northeast Dallas. Andrea Lucia is live at the apartments tonight with the very latest. Andrea. I talked to several residents here at the apartments. They did not want to go on camera, but they did express frustration at the crime they feel goes unaddressed in this area. In this case, Dallas police say the victim was an employee here at the Vineyards at Forest Edge apartment complex. A witness shared these pictures of paramedics trying to help the man as he lay sprawled on the ground unconscious. They took him to a local hospital, but were ultimately unable to save him. Police say the victim pulled into his parking spot around 3 in the afternoon, but as soon as he got out of his car, they say he was approached by two men demanding he hand over his belongings. Police say there was a struggle during which one of the robbers pulled a gun and shot the victim. Witnesses say the two men then ran off. The Dallas County Medical Examiner's Office has not yet released the identity of the victim. Reporting live in Dallas, Andrea Lucia, CBS 11 News. All right, Andrea, thank you very much. This is the same apartment complex, by the way, where Dallas police were involved in a wild chase involving a carjacking suspect. Police say Austin Reed carjacked a driver at the Vineyards at Forest Edge apartment complex last month. He ended up running into a stranger's home during that chase, while a man who lived there was inside of the house. Police eventually shot Reed and then took him into custody.